golfing, spending time with friends and family, moving to a less crowded community. Just some of the things many people do when they retire. <laughs> but a local man is on a mission to make a difference, spending 20 hours a week volunteering with adults with disabilities. We work in the kitchen. Right? It's chat time at JARC, an organization which provides programs and services for people who have intellectual and developmental disabilities. Curd carrots. Shelly Pittleman volunteers his time. I would talk about anything they want to talk about. Uh, if, it's, if it's girls, if they have a new girlfriend, and um, uh, how, to, how to treat other people, because they always treat people with dignity and respect. Because that's how they want to be treated. We're begging them up today. Shelley says he was an economist and investment planner. He retired 15 years ago. He started volunteering. For me, it's the right thing to do. I have a lot of friends that really sit at home. They're retired, and they'll watch TV, maybe play golf a couple of times a week. That wouldn't be my style. That, that wouldn't be for me. Shelley also volunteers for other organizations. I just happen to like being in the community, particularly serving people that have a right to be, uh, uh, to be served and, uh, and have a good time. The 76-year-old devotes so much of his time, he was awarded the JARC Volunteer of the Year Award. He walks in the building, everybody knows who he is, they're very excited to see him, and, uh, you know, he just, he sits in our boardroom with his groups, and they literally just rap, you know, they talk about whatever topics come up. Anything you can do to help people that need help is a great thing, not just for them, but for you too. If you know of anyone who is doing something special for the community, please help us share their story. Just send an email.